Squad guys. I think I'm the only crazy RVer who is bringing a mouse into their RV. What do you think of my new pet mouse? He's a baby, so it's the perfect time, they say. You take the babies, and they can actually be trained because they're still little. So I went to PetSmart and got him this cute little house, and cute little food dish, and a wheel to exercise on, and it had an extra slipper that didn't fit. I got it on sale and it ended up being too small. So meet Gus Gus. He is my RV mouse. He hasn't quite gotten the hang of how that wheel works yet. Let's see the slipper. I cut the toe off and sewn, I sewed it together at the base to make this little hole and inside is this really fluffy fluffy warm stuff. So he's got his own little hut. And then the toilet paper there, you won't see that long. I put that in here so that he could, uh, they say they, uh, make their houses out of, like, ripping it up and stuff. So that's why that's in there. And then in the back here, in the corner, let's see if I can get a better view here. In the back corner, can you see it? Okay, you see the little dish there? Now that's not only to catch the water from the water bottle, because it does occasionally leak. So there's a water bottle, just for a little small animal. It's got a little turtle there to tell you when it needs to be filled. And he's already figured out how to use that. But during the, uh, when it gets really hot, I can also put water in there so he can get in there and cool off if he wants to. So I thought that was pretty brilliant on my part. But yeah, I just wanted you guys to meet Gus Gus. At least that's his name for now until I figure out if it's a girl. But I think it's a boy. He's pretty scared right now. He hides in the corner when he's scared. Hi, hey, buddy. So I'm going to let him be. He was out, so I wanted to show y'all. There is my little setup for him. And at night, I put... At night, he's got these steak lights. I'm sure you guys have seen them. So I put these here and here. And at night, it adds just a little bit of light in his cage so that I can see what he's doing because that's when he's most active. So yeah, I thought that was pretty brilliant on my part. I am still organizing stuff in the rig, but I will give you guys another video shortly. Just wanted you to meet Gus Gus. See you later. Alright guys, I'm trying to, there we go, zoom in. He's being so cute right now. He's eating the sunflower seed. And I figured I'd zoom in instead of getting too close, because he's freaked out otherwise. And my camera is not wanting to zoom. Sorry. There we go. Yeah, a sunflower seed. Those are apparently his favorite. He's a picky mouse. He picks through all the food and only eats the sunflower seeds. I had a better view of him, but by the time I got the camera up, he was in the wheel again. And I don't want to go over there and freak him out, because I already freaked him out enough for one day. He still has to be trained, so... Eventually... Eventually I'll be able to hold him and do stuff with him. So right now I'm just trying to get him used to my smell and used to having, you know, see me right next to him. And Anyway, I did all the research on Google, so yeah, I know what I'm doing. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys how cute he was. See you later. <laughs>